Wakanda forever. Hey, what's up, you guys? Film fan 0599 here again, and today we're going to review Black Panther. So, Black Panther stars Chadwick Boseman, Michael B. Jordan, Lupita Nyongo, Martin Freeman, Daniel Kahula, uh, Angelique Benson, Fordis Whitaker, and Andy Serkis. And what this film is basically about it's about, you know, uh, T'Challa, aka Black Panther. He's now, you know, the king of Wakanda. He's now the king of Wakanda, and he now needs to basically figure out how to balance that while being the Black Panther at the same time. And also, someone unknown has now come to Wakanda and kind of wants the throne. So, what did I think of Black Panther? Now, going into Black Panther, I was very excited for this movie, obviously. Um, you know, I really love the character of Black Panther a lot, actually. Um... The first time I was ever introduced to him was in the uh, Marvel's Ultimate Alliance game. And then I saw him in Ultimate Avengers 2, the animated film. And But what really made me really love the character even more was when I saw him in Civil War. And I couldn't wait. And I loved Chadwick Boseman in that movie as the character. I was so I was so excited to see what they could do with his own solo film. And I gotta say, it was really great. I really enjoyed Black Panther a lot. Black Panther is a great film. I quite had a blast with it, honestly. It is a very enjoyable movie. I really had a great time with Black Panther. But let's get into my positives with Black Panther. Let's let's see what I liked about the film. So going into the positives, first being the acting. It's my favorite element of the whole film. My favorite element of this entire movie is the, the casting and arrangement of characters. That is my favorite thing about this whole entire film. Marvel knows how to get great ensemble casts. Look at the Avengers, uh, Captain America Civil War, Guardians of the Galaxy, and now Black Panther is now added to that of just great ensemble casts with Marvel films. Because the cast they got in here is insane. It really is. The amount of talent they have in this movie is insane. And everyone fills in their part well. Like, there's never a time where I felt like a character was wasted. I felt like every character had a purpose to be there, and they were used correctly. And I liked that a lot, honestly. Like, no character to me was wasted in this movie. And that was great, because I really liked all the characters in this film. They were really great, they were really well developed, they were fantastic, honestly. It's my favorite element of this entire film. Um, first being with Chadwick Boseman as T'Challa slash Black Panther. He's great, I love him as this character. He's fantastic, he embodies this character so well. He does an amazing job of really embodying the character of Black Panther. I thought he was fantastic in the film, and I quite enjoyed him a lot, and he did a really solid job. I really loved him in this film. Michael B. Jordan was great. This is definitely, I want to say, one of the best villains we've seen in the Marvel film. Honestly, he was great. He had a motivation that was fantastic. I really loved him a lot, and he was threatening. He was a menacing villain. He was threatening, and I liked him a lot. He did a fantastic job. I thought Michael B. Jordan gave a really phenomenal performance in the film. He was really fantastic. I quite enjoyed him a lot in this movie. It's definitely, like I said, one of the best Marvel villains we've seen so far. Um, I thought Daniel Kahula was great. I really liked him a lot in the film. It was great seeing him. Lupita Nyong'o was fantastic, too. Uh, Martin Freeman was great as well. I quite enjoyed him. Andy Serkis, man. Andy Serkis. He, even though he's not in the film all that much, I liked him for the screen time he had. He was great. He steals the show. He really does. I quite enjoyed him a lot. Uh, Angeline Benson was great as well. Same goes for Forrest Whitaker. Just the whole cast in general, like I said, is fantastic. Everyone does a fantastic job in the film. There's never a time in the movie where I felt like any character was wasted or an actor was not given that well of a performance. I really thought everyone was great. Like I said, it's probably my favorite element of this entire film. I love the arrangement of characters in this movie. Definitely one of the best um, ensemble casts we've seen in a Marvel film thus far. The action sequences are fantastic. I really love the action sequences in this movie. They are really great and really well filmed as well. Um, they're, the best action scene, I'll just say, involves, a ch a, like, a car chase. It's great. Like, I really love that 
uh, action scene a lot. Definitely one of the best action scenes we've seen in a Marvel film, to be honest. And they were just really awesome. I really loved how they were filmed and really well executed. They were great. There were some fantastic action sequences in this movie. The humor was really good, too, actually. You know, this is not like a comedy or anything, but it's that typical Marvel humor you see in all the Marvel films. And it's great. Like, I really enjoyed that a lot. There were some moments that really did have me laughing. I was like, you know, that was actually pretty good. And I actually thought it was really funny, honestly. Um, the music is fantastic. I love the music with this movie. The music is incredible. Both the both the soundtrack, you know, that Kendrick Lamar made, and the score. Like, they're both fantastic. They both fit with the movie so well, honestly. They really fit with the atmosphere of the world of Wakanda and stuff like that. It really is great. Like, I really love how the music added to certain scenes in this movie. It really did add a lot to those scenes. I thought it was fantastic. So, both the soundtrack by Kendrick Lamar and the score are really great with this movie. I really thought they fit the movie very, very well. Definitely some of the best music we've heard in a Marvel film thus far. Um, the writing is fantastic with this movie. I thought the writing was incredible. Uh, the directing is amazing. Ryan Coogler directed this film, and he does such a fantastic job directing it. It's very well shot, very well edited. The cinematography is really fantastic with this movie. Ryan Coogler really outdid himself with this movie. He really did do a fantastic job directing the film. I thought he did an immensely amazing job directing this movie. Like I said, it's very well shot. Editing's fantastic. Cinematography is really great with this movie. So yeah, Ryan Coogler did an absolutely amazing job directing the film. Um, the visual effects for the most part I thought were really good. I really liked them a lot, especially how they did Wakanda. How they did Wakanda was insane. I really loved how they captured the atmosphere of that world. It was really fantastic. I really loved that a lot. It really embodied and captured the feel of Wakanda. And it was fantastic. And it really made you invested and really immersed and lost in that world. And I really liked that a lot. I thought they did an excellent job with that. And yeah, there, I really thought some a lot of the special effects for the most part were really good actually. And lastly, for the most part, the pacing's really good too. I thought the movie actually moved at a nice, solid pace for the most part. It's 2 hours and 14 minutes, and, you know, for the most part, I really didn't feel the pacing, honestly. Like, I felt it moved at a nice, natural pace. Now, there are some negatives I do have with Black Panther, and those negatives being, first being, uh, sometimes, it, it's mostly towards the finale of the movie that the CGI looks really noticeable. That's really when I thought the CGI looked really noticeable, especially during, like, one fight scene, and, uh, like, they introduced some, like, rhinos into the finale. Oh, like, they looked, honestly, like, really bad. So, yeah, only, the only time, like I said, for the most part, the visual effects are really good. But when it gets towards the finale of the movie, that's when you kind of notice it. So, yeah, uh, yeah, it's kind of special effects, like, you really notice it. So, yeah. And lastly, the movie can move a little bit slow at times. There are some points where I did think the movie did move a bit slow. I thought it could have picked up a little bit, but only at times. Besides that, I really loved Black Panther a lot. Black Panther is another fantastic Marvel film. I thought they did an absolutely fantastic job with that. I really had a blast with this film. So it's time for my official grade on Black Panther. And my official grade on Black Panther is an A-. minus. I quite loved Black Panther a lot, like I said. It's a fantastic Marvel film. They really did another phenomenal job with uh, this movie. I really loved Black Panther a lot. It has some great, great characters and great acting, great action sequences. You know, just, it's really fantastic. I really love this movie a lot, and you should definitely go check it out. So, definitely deserves an A-. minus. So, if you guys have seen Black Panther, what did you think of it? Leave it in the comment section below. I'm FilmFan0599, and we will see you out later. Peace.